Get it guys, another week, another update. First things first, we finally default to walking. So yes, we are now a, a true tactical game because we walk by default. Because you know, that's what makes a tactical game, right? Uh, anyway, a lot of work uh, on the animation tree this week. So walking and running now yeah, looks a hell of a lot better. As well as the blending between the two. Things like uh, if you run one direction and suddenly change, it blends a lot better and actually holds. So if you start shooting, go to full automatic here, and I start shooting while one direction and move, it should hold for a moment before switching around. So things like that should be good for gameplay so you won't get stuck out with your view suddenly changing when you're still firing away. Quite like that. Also worked on the penetration issues I had with very thin walls, BSP or static meshes, so now they don't pose a problem at all. It just ignores the uh, issue now. Small little check. Also added penetration for players. So if I walk up to this gentleman here, take a shot at him, not only will it go through him and leave a nice exit wound in every single guy, but it actually takes care of uh, multiple attack penetration as well. So I shoot him in the leg here should go through both his legs. I still have to work on it deviating so it hits his leg and turns around and comes out his chest, but at least the basics are there. The same bit of code can be used to detect whether it hits pouches or helmets. Whether or not we decide to do that, I'm not sure yet, but uh, we can actually do it. Anyway guys, that's it for this week. Have a good one.